Yeah, so, you know, I, I figured let me just uh, run you through this project, uh, kind of how it started and what the inspiration for this electric bike is. Uh, you know, I reached out to uh, the guys over at Rough Cycles. I don't even think it was three months ago. Uh, and I got Piro, who, who owns the company, right on the phone. Uh, I told him my idea uh, to do a PJD electric bike. He loved it, and uh, we jumped in with both feet. Before you know it, we were on Zoom calls doing the design work, and I knew right away the inspiration for this bike would be this bike right here. This is my build-off two bike. Uh, this is a bike I'm one of the bikes we're most proud of. Um, and uh, when I thought electric bicycle, I thought, man, we got to use inspiration from this bad boy right here. And you can see, you know, I, I work in theme, right? If you know what I do for a living and build all these bikes through all these years on American Chopper, um, I build in theme. So what better way to come up with an electric bicycle than to build it off of a theme from one of my best bikes. And as you can see, you know, with the white walls and the red rims and the, the color combination, the pinstripe, uh, we rolled all that into this bike. Now it's not literal, but it's definitely interpretive. It has a lot of the qualities this has, and you can see it's like, this is this bike's little brother. And that's really what we wanted to do. And what, what was beautiful about the relationship is this is a perfect example of German engineering meets American innovation and creativity. I mean, it's such a great combination. Um, the PJD team and the team over there at Rough Cycles really came together to make what you see here happen. So this was a great collaboration where I was able to really come up with designs to infuse into Rough Cycles, Ruffian, and come up with the PJD e-bike. And I can't remember the last time I worked collaboratively with a company where it was so seamless and effortless. And the crazy part is, you know, we, we were on two separate sides of the world, um, but we spoke the same language and it's evident in what you see in this bicycle. And just to walk you around real quick, you can see, uh, you can see how similar this bicycle is to uh, my, my bike here, we did the, the red rims and you can see the pinstripe, even this white pinstripe leading into uh, my namesake, the Paul Jr. Designs, the logo, the number seven, which has been so iconic. You can't see it on this bike, it's on the other side. Um, but the number seven has been such an important number uh, for me and my company through the years. Even this scoop down on the bottom with the seven on it, just the right amount of placement with the numbers. And you could just see the overall lines, the handlebars. It's crazy when I park this bike in with my motorcycles, it just looks like it belongs there. And that's really a testament uh, to two different companies coming together and just coming out with an amazing, unique, great product.